Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. And today, I literally just got this. We're going to review some of the Monin syrups, coffee syrups I just got. Ooh. If you watched my last video, I did already make a ube latte. I got a couple of sugar-free or zero sugar options as well as some normal, like I think I got vanilla. No, I got the ube and I got the salted caramel. And for my sugar-free options or for my, to make coffees for my husband who's a diabetic and prefers sugar-free options, I got him caramel and vanilla. So for Monin, I just remember ordering pistachio syrup. That's literally all I remember, and it took longer to get to me for whatever reason, I don't know why, um, than the Tarani. So I ordered the Monin first. I ordered Tarani like three days later, and I got Tarani earlier. Doesn't matter at this point, because they both got to me, so that's all that matters. So let me open, Ooh, this is what it looks like. When I, I also ended up, oh, it's a thank you. I also ended up ordering some of the because I couldn't find them on Amazon at a reasonable price. I, I used a discount. I think I used Alex Mojica's Monin discount. So I, I so it ended up being cheaper anyway for me to just order the syrups and the pumps from Monin directly instead of having to wait for Amazon to get them in stock and two, to have a similar price because it, well, the price difference was pretty big, I think. Um, especially the pistachio one. I think the pistachio one was like $7 more on Amazon. And and it kept going in and out of stock. So anyway, enough complaining, let me open. So I got four pumps in my order because I bought four coffee syrups. Oh, and I also got these caps. I wonder if this cap will fit on my Tarani cap. Do you think it'll fit? I think it fits. It's like a pack of 20 of these pump caps. I think it fits. We're just gonna leave it on there. <gasps> I'm just organizing everything today and I'm sure my husband is gonna be like, is this, are we starting a coffee shop in the living room? Yes, we are, for me. And I guess for him too, if I can get him to switch over. Ooh! These bottles are so pretty. Okay, so the pistachio one is the one that I have been, I feel like I've been harping about it for months and months and I keep saying I'm going to, um, <laughs> I'm gonna make a latte because I keep thinking about the Starbucks one. No joke, I still think about it to this day, how delicious, my hair's in my face, how delicious the <laughs> pistachio latte was when Starbucks had it in like January of this year. So I bought this because that's what I wanna make. I'm actually gonna make a recipe with it at the end because that is the one syrup that I have been been thinking about for months and I also and I saw a TikTok that had was using this syrup so this is spiced brown sugar because who doesn't like spiced brown sugar these are packaged so well let me say and macadamia nut so those were actually I saw a recipe on TikTok of course of someone using macadamia nut and a brown sugar syrup and it's supposed to be amazing it sounds amazing so I thought well I might as well get it because why not so macadamia and then the last one is just french vanilla just for myself when I'm feeling vanilla. -y. I don't always get vanilla, but I thought I'd have it just for myself, just for whenever. These bottles, can I say, are so pretty. Look at this. I am not sure if Monin, I actually didn't even check. I'm not sure if Monin even has any sugar-free, no sugar options. So I only got just like regular one, regular syrups for myself and that'll do. Like I said, I am probably the main coffee drinker. My husband drinks coffee every day. Actually, story time. My husband never, never drank coffee like growing up or in high school, college, anything. Um, I think he took me on one Starbucks date when we were dating, when we were children and um, Anyway, and he just never had coffee. He never liked it. He never really, it was never a habit that he had and it was never something he liked to drink. He didn't really care for it until, until we had our daughter. When, when we had our daughter, it was like team no sleep, another no sleep, another, you know that song, another no sleep, another exhausted day. So he started drinking coffee and since then, He's an avid coffee drinker, and at this point, he drinks it every single day. But he's not into super like flavored coffees. So he doesn't really care for that. I, on the other hand, want like a cute, fancy, like special drink, and I feel like why not? Let me open up. Oh, this gives you instructions right on here on the Monin pump packaging. So this says one pump is one a quarter fluid ounces, so eight ml, and that's it. Okay, so I am essentially going to do the same thing I did if you did it on my previous video with my Tarani syrups. I'm essentially gonna do the same thing. I am going to put two pumps of this in, oh, this is so pretty. Ooh, 
I'm going to put two pumps of this syrup into my almond milk. I'm gonna use unsweetened almond milk, froth it, and then I think I'm going to, I think I'm gonna pick Altizio. It's one shot. Let me put this pump together. Are you one of those people that follows directions? Like reads the instructions? I don't. This is super easy to open. If you saw my last video, the Tarani was not easy to open. Oh my gosh, it smells. I didn't even get that close to it. It smells exactly like pistachio. <gasps> and it comes with its own little cover. Look at this little baby. And I love that Monin does this. I don't know if you can even see this. Do you see this? It's probably too far. They have a recipe for an iced latte and even a mocha with their syrup. All right, where's my milk frother? I know, I've got to clean up this area. It's a mess. We're gonna do two pumps in here with unsweetened almond milk, just like plain. Okay, that was like two and a half pumps because the first one came out kind of weak. I'm gonna use this just plain almond breeze, nothing special. I'm trying to do everything. Where's the line? I'm trying to be super careful because this is gold. Time to froth. I'm gonna use this glass again and I'm sure it's gonna be delicious. I can't wait, I'm so excited. So it's all froth, I don't know if you can see it. It's not green. I was actually kind of hoping it would turn green, but it is not green. There's a little bit left, but I think we're just gonna leave it. Look how beautiful this is though. I mean, I guess it's a little bit green. I'm back. Oh, this is really hot. Look at the layers. So pretty, it's very light. I'm gonna mix it because it's funny down. Oh wow, that's really good. Really nutty flavor. I feel like it probably could have gone with like another half pump or something, but it's still very light, very good. The coffee is delicious. Mm, that's so good. That is so good. I wonder if I can add like like a, like a paste or something, if that would have made it even a little bit more of a stronger pistachio flavor. I'm gonna try another pump. Where am I? Okay, some more. Mm, that's better. That's better. But now I am curious. I really like it. This is amazing. I'm so excited to try all of these different coffees or all of the different coffees that I will be able to make because I have so many different syrups now. That is the video. Thanks so much for coming and watching the video about this. I mean, this is like the star of the show. Well, it's supposed to be the star of the show. I haven't decided yet. I, I really like it. I feel like there could have been a little bit more of a stronger like flavor. And I may have to order the Tarani one too. <laughs> no hate, no shade. I am curious to know if there is a huge flavor difference, if I would prefer it more because it's not, it's just not giving that flavor that I have in my mind. And it also just could be because it's not like a paste. It's not like, because I know the um, Starbucks sauce was like, I think a little bit of a thicker sauce. It wasn't a syrup, it was like a paste. I've been hyping this up in my head for months and now I'm, I feel slightly disappointed. Like it, I feel it is giving me that flavor of pistachio that I really wanted, but it's not the flavor that I remember or it's not as good. I don't know. Thanks so much for watching. I'm so excited to try all these other syrups and I'll post videos of recipes if I come up with one or if I, if I like, like I'm gonna, I'm gonna. Um, I am going, I do plan on mixing these two, maybe a pump of each because that's what I saw on TikTok and I feel like TikTok knows, knows me. So I'm going to do that um, and I'll post it at some point. But anyway, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate the comments. I appreciate the likes. It really helps out my channel. Um, I'm growing slowly and I am putting a lot more effort into my videos than I did before. I'm really loving coffee and beauty content. So expect to see more of that from me along with vlogs. Thanks so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you next one. Bye.